Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is the Face Sturgis and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy in the last episode. You're back. And in one piece no less. Oh, but I already spoke with you, but okay, let's do it again. It is Professor Rookwood. Uh-huh. Thank you, Professor. Good. I am ready indeed. Ready. In that case. Yeah, that is the third one. The headmistress, and we already covered this in the last one, so I'm just going to Wait, skip it. I am. However, okay. Of course. Professor, if you learn very well. Okay, nice. Let's talk to Professor Fig. I know, I know. Continue to hone my magic. You do learn quickly. Hopefully, you will soon hear from Lodgok as well. And we shall learn how he fared with the helmet you retrieved. Well done today, as always. We shall speak again soon. Okay. Oh, it's winter. Game of Thrones of Honor. Okay, nice. I don't know if this locks me out of uh, any other activities or something, but to be honest, I don't really care. I just want to, well, basically be done with it. Ah, there we go. Oh, this is my owl. Let's go ahead and read the mail. Okay, no new mail has come yet. Quests, no assignments. <coughs> Inventory gear-wise, I am at 15 out of 32. Uh, visit to the room of requirements might be a good idea. But for now, as always, let's just prance. There we go. Not really. I have been asked to teach you the exploding charm, Bombarda. Once you have completed the tasks I've set forth, speak to me after class. Okay. Well, there we go. We have the bo we have the class thing. I kind of want to go with a different handle to spice things up a little bit. Although most of these things actually look like broken up dildos, but whatever. This one seems to be the most elegant. Uh, what else did I want? Okay, let's actually take a look at the quests. Fire and Vice, meet Poppy Sweating. Acquire a Diri di di Call with the Knapsack. Okay, follow the dead, talk to Dick in the room of requirement. Okay. I need to head on over to the room of requirements anyways, so we might as well go ahead and do that. Uh, so let's go over here and... No, no, no. Room of requirement. Kaboom, kabam, kabababubububam. Do you understand what I mean? There we go. For you, Dick, my boy, I have as many moments uh, as many moments uh, as many moments as you might need. Hello, Dick. Hello, Dick. Indeed. Hmm? A Dick thought. I would like that. that. Sounds like a rescuing and breeding beasts go hand in hand. Breeding beasts here in the room will allow us to. I see. First, bring a pair of beasts to the room. One male, one female. Noble creatures, but the relationship uh -huh. with death gives them... I've seen Thestrals before, but where would I find a pair? Deke has seen some wild Thestrals. 
Then you'll need to purchase a spellcraft for the pen from Tomes and Scrolls. And once you've rescued the Thestrals and you have... Okay, so... Purchase breathing pen, spellcraft. Okay, so I need to head on over to Hogsmeade anyways. So let me just quickly identify all of the gear that I have acquired. Okay. Let me see if there are any upgrades that I have found. Most likely there are not, but still. Okay. Map. Let's head on over to Hogsmeade. Okay, so I'll need to buy. Then go talk to Crispin Dune. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's nice. But where would I go about? Oh, okay, I need to head on over there. Okay, perfect. So we're just going to go to Hogsmeade. It's gonna be great, terrific, unbelievable. Then what we're gonna want to do is just get a bunch of other stuff ready. And that'll be it. Hopefully. Okay, the spellcraft I can actually buy from this side over here. B bitch. Oh, nice. So that puts up the staircase up there. Okay, nice, 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 nice. Let's look at what we have, shall we? I spell the country breathing pen to breathe bits in your. Nothing like finding just the right thing, is there? Well, I didn't quite have really much of a choice in uh, finding the right thing. It was more of uh, I needed to buy that thing. Well, luckily, I think I've made back most of the money, so I will need to rescue a male first all, which shouldn't really be that much of a problem. Apparently, I have a female first all already. So let's actually go ahead and get this quest. So, I mean, we're already at Hogsmeade, might as well, you know, get another quest. Have something to do and whatnot. I do hope Mary and her neighbors aren't home. Excuse me, sir. Just barely, but I don't want to trouble a student. I am mm -hmm. a student, but I can... I'm not so sure. Name's Crispin Dunn, by the way. A lovely little hamlet. Just stunning gardens, just the... Actually, b before I... No. Spiders don't bother me at all. You'd be impressed by how many I've dispatched. Lucky you. The hamlet's overrun... Oh, okay. I'm concerned about my customers, of course, but it appears that most... It's my friend Mary I worry about. Understandable, but why don't I would? But I have a crippling fear of the eight legged beasts. I don't know what to do. I'll see what I can do. I'll try my very best, Mr. Dunn. Please do. If you can think of it, they'll find Aaron Shaw southeast of Hogs. Okay, I know where that's at, so let's go ahead and uh, check on Mary. Mary shouldn't really be that much of a problem, in all honesty, so. Let me just check for any other additional side quests that we can catch. Meet Poppy Sweating, okay. So, enemy table, yeah, that's all well and good. Tarsal Den, okay. Infamous Foe. I kind of want to go there. Okay, yeah, we're good. We're, we're gonna go there to defeat that infamous foe. Now that I have, ooh, now that I have the uh, Curcio charm, that uh, not charm, curse. Yeah, that's a black cat. That's usually a bad omen. Okay, and we gotta keep our eye out uh, for first alls. That's also something that I gotta keep in mind. Mm-hmm. 
it's Quib Cottage. Okay, yeah, that's interesting. Okay, next up is that one over there. How about some sightseeing? Wait, what? Ah, okay, right. It's all about the broom, eh? Ah, complexes. I guess they're a universal thing. In any case, there is this infamous foe here that I actually failed to notice, but I would like to be rid of that. Yeah, there we go. Go ahead and just land over here. Rebellion. Okay. Okay. So the infamous foe should be somewhere roughly over here. There we go. Yeah, that's just a regular duelist. Where's this infamous foe? That you keep uh, ramming on. Ah, oh, Tempest Forn. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, there you are. Really? That's an infamous foe. What a joker. Okay. <laughs> Bitch. Okay. Well, I mean, so much for an infamous foe. Let's break it down into regions. Okay, so there should be two more infamous foes around here. But I guess they come and go then. Thank you. Let's stick with the quest. Um, I actually just noticed it, so I thought I'd go there and take care of it. But uh, yeah, the infamous foe wasn't real. Let's keep an eye on Holy the Jesus. There we go. Of course. Spiders are... Basically most of the time they can be quite aggressive. Okay, also depending on the species that is. Okay, you know what? The Inferno spell might be a better pick for this one. But it is what it is, you know? So currently this is all that we have. Nice. I'll meet you as soon as I'm done with this. Nice. Okay. Surely that's the last of them. Yeah, you would think so, wouldn't you? But in most cases, no. This cellar gate looks to be locked. I need a key to enter. Aloha Mora, my dude. Rebellion. It's like a what? Oh no, this must be Mary. Uh, the little the spider venom is a pumped payment is now due. The new class of spider venom is my cell workshops have almost hatched. More well, venom soon once, of course, I have been compensated for the last delivery. Underground. I'll need to destroy every last spider in that cellar if this is to end. Okay. We shall need the key then. Am I crazy? Do you hear that like whispering sound? 
No, I must be insane, but for who was she actually making the venom? That is something that we should be asking as one of the questions, if you do, don't mind me saying so. Okay. If you're not the epitome of observation and investigation skills, then I don't know who is. Freaking idiot. Spiders have gone somewhere. Psh, freaking mystery. Real mystery. Not sure I want to know where this leads. Mm -hmm. Let's be ready for whatever I may find down there. Okay. The, uh, yeah, he said that. I need to find and destroy all of these before the situation gets. That's one exact point. I should get the rest. Yeah, you really should. There we go. Nice. And kabam. Bam bam alakazam. These eggs must be destroyed. Revelio. Well, you did only say it 500 times, but I guess we do need to destroy those eggs. Yeah, you know, since he said it like 500 times, it must be true. Nice. Okay, yeah, there are plenty of egg sacs, plenty of uh, spiders in general here. We will need to get rid of all of them. Now I have said it as well. I mean, freaking hell. But how do you know that half is finished? Like, you cannot know for certain that half is finished. You know? That is just not a thing that you can know. Until you had a good look. It's a good thing I have the mandrake. Well, I found the perfect place to build my spider colony. It was quite literally under my nose the whole time. My cellar. Why didn't I think of this before? Why hasn't anyone for that matter? My spiders are growing big and strong, and the cell they produce will make me a fortune. I have wealth at last. No more escaping on frogs. When I'm in town, it will be marvelous. She was breeding the spiders. Revelio. Well, that much was pretty obvious. I mean, jump down. Yeah, trust me, if I didn't want you to jump down, I wouldn't tell you to jump down. So don't worry about that. Revelio. Confringo. <laughs> There we go, that one can be blasted. Okay, yeah, that's valid. That's completely valid. Okay. And by the way, they definitely see you and you definitely don't see them. That much is uh, freaking guaranteed. Nice, I destroyed the last one. Perfect. But where's Mama? Yeah, no, we haven't seen Mama. That's what's actually worrying me, is that we haven't seen the mama spider. You know, it would make sense for us to be ambushed right about now. In this big open space, right? Yep.
Yeah, there we go. That was the mama spider. Nice. Okay, perfect. I actually really love this method of traveling. That's the last one. She's angry. The insatiable spider. Crucio. No, not really. I mean, the fight was relatively easy, so... There we go. Bam. Okay, I'm definitely overusing Crucio. I'll give you that much. That is definitely the case and I don't really care. Right, we have the breeding pens. Uh, I really need to collect the male thingamajig. Soon as we turn this quest in back at Hogsmeade. But yeah, that should be the last of the spiders overall. We defeated the... The mama spider and the father spider. This will be a breath of fresh air. Let's get out of here quickly. Come on, baby. Could we seal up this entire thing? I think that would be most beneficial to everybody involved. Just to seal up the entirety of the basement. But I guess not. I had to guess I would say that the spiders overwhelmed her. And that was it. You know, it happens. Yeah, you're breeding spiders, everything's going great one day, then all of a sudden they turn against you. This is because they most likely do, but you're just not realizing it. Like all roads lead to Rome. Most of the roads lead to Rome. A large portion of them, as a matter of fact, actually do lead to Rome. Mr. Dunn, I have some news. Thank Merlin. About my sweet friend Mary. She... It seems poor Mary was breeding spiders in her home for profit. And vastly underestimated their propensity to multiply. Oh Mary, what untoward scheme were you involved in? If she needed financial assistance, she could have just come to me. She didn't deserve this. Few do. I am sorry about mm -hmm. your friend. You'll be relieved to know that I cleared out the spiders. It's safe to return now. You? You cleared out the spiders? I can't believe it, but I'm certainly relieved. I imagine the first order of business will be to help the amulet rebuild. I suppose I have nothing to fear from dead spiders. Even so, you'll want to prepare yourself. The place needs something of a uh, clean-up. Thank you again. For <laughs> I shall keep you apprised of the hamlet's rebuilding. Glad I could be of help. And I look forward to visiting your shop the next time I'm in Aronshire. Nice. Departed Mary. Well, okay, that was a nice uh, little quest, nice little uh, side distraction. I'm about to hit level 31 soon. So let us see what is next on the agenda. Uh, I think actually... Fall of the Dead, that is something that I do want to do. Okay, so let us head on over here. I don't want to get a male one and well, we shall breed them, why not? I don't necessarily see the point of it, but okay. 
Yes, it certainly does. Okay. Let's see about the mail first. Oh, there they are. Yep, that one is mail. Get over here. Now we can conjure a breeding pen in the room. Let's get back to deep with the Thestrals. Well, okay, actually, uh, for her thing for Bombarda, uh, actually, no. What the f mm? am I doing? Uh, I need a Dirical. I have no idea what a Dirical is, so... Jobber Knuckle, Giant Purple Toad, Terstal, Niffler then, okay, Niffler is the, is a Potipus, Small Bandit Camp, Mooncalf, Unicorn, I do have a unicorn. Horflunk Hollow, okay. Puffskin. Niffler. Okay. Puffskin. Right, I need a Diriclaw. Diriclaw. Surprised I haven't actually found it yet. Dirical, Dirical, Dirical. Mongrel, okay, Dugbore. Uh, maybe, but just maybe. If I were to track this quest, it will show me on the map. Yep, over here. Then inhabited by the Reclose. There is an ancient magic hotspot and a Merlin trial as well. Over here is another Merlin trial. So, and over here we have another one. And over here we have another one. Okay, so we're basically just going to go ahead and travel to this one. Do the Merlin's trial. Then get the, the thing that we need to get. And that will actually complete the quest. Quite a dirical. Out of all of the things you need a dirical. I mean, come on. What even is a dirical? Knowing my luck is gonna be one of those creepy things. Okay. Fucking Mm. Don't swear. Okay, Mallow Sweet. Nice. That's one. That's two. Those are some Ashwing eggs. Nice. Could I get an Ashwing? I believe that. Now, those are a bunch of. Uh, there we go. There you go. I do believe that would uh, complete the Merlin trial. Mm-hmm. Or are there more of them? There are probably more of them, uh, in all honesty. And an anvil to the head. I know you're the one who stole Well, I'm terribly sorry that uh You've been looking for me. If only I knew I would have made your search that much easier. Okay, Revelio. Okay. Nothing is a waste of time if you do it right. Akio, 
There we go. Well, if I am a novice, you'll be getting your arse handed to you by a novice student. So, yeah, you should probably reevaluate your uh, your approach. I know you. Mm-hmm. The beasts are safe now. Of course they are. Revelio. Alright, there's the last one. Hop, hop. Perfect. Well, they really shouldn't because they're really that easy. But it doesn't matter, we've just been doing Merlin Trials throughout every episode, little by little, we, we, we will get there eventually. Right, there is an Ancient Magic Hotspot and another Merlin Trial down here. And another Merlin Trial up here with a small bandit camp. And a treasure vault. Which in all honesty I am tempted to do and we shall do it. Because it's all relatively close by, it's like 200 meters difference, you know? The beasts will be there and they'll be actually waiting for us, so... It doesn't really matter all that much, you know? This place has seen better days. Really, you think so? Well, who would have thunk it? Okay, we completed the bandit camp. Let's use the mellow suite. Okay, it's one of those things. Okay. So everything is supposed to line up. Um, there we go. There we go. And let me just... There we go. That one lines up perfectly. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Now, oh, okay. Oh, nice. This one is also... Oh yeah, it's so terribly close to being aligned as well. Ah, okay. Okay. There we go. That one is lined up. Oh, nice, we have a bunch of Ashwind eggs here. Which is perfect. Um... Right, there should be one more. Yeah, here it is. Okay. So... Let's go like this. Okay. Yeah, that's almost close. There we go. What's that? Is that a rush? Another one down. There is a lot of them, but they can all be solved fairly easily. It's just time consuming to do all of them. Okay. Yeah, I can see both of the items. Both of the ancient magics are up there. Abandoned long ago, 
Well, you must be freaking Shakespeare. And yeah, there is... Yeah, fall down. Fucking fall down, you cunt. There we go. I mean, it's a shame, but it is what it is. No. There you go. Okay, we got that. Let's actually get... Oh, right, there's this treasure vault down here. And I really uh, want to get as well, so... Let us work towards that. <coughs> okay, so it's down here somewhere. Okay, hold on. One of the rare instances where Reparo is actually <laughs> useful. <laughs> this looks intriguing. Yeah. <coughs> Sorry about that. Yes, it does. That's why we're here. Okay. Oh, well, so I just get close to it, and that's it. Revelio. Oh well, okay. I mean, I don't mind it. Probably one of the spells that I've hit it with did perhaps something, but in all honesty, it's so meh for me that I don't really care. Defender. There we go. Okay, let's go over into the map, mark the full flame. Gotta have all of the full flames unlocked, if nothing else. Mm-hmm. Northfeld Croft, and what do we have down here? Yeah, we're just going to leave that one be, and we're just going to go towards that Merlin trial over there. And that'll be very good. I think I'm going to actually uh, get rid of Curcio. And basically just have Bombarda instead. Because I'll be perfectly honest, I don't really see the point of having, uh, what do you call it? Yeah. Oh, man. I just love it when I'm able to do that. Yep, get over here. Nice. Yeah, you're in for a world of hurt. Oh, I should actually play some StarCraft. That would be awesome. Too late for you to learn the error of your ways. I allowed them to learn the arrows, the errors of their ways. If you can just kill them. I don't see the... Well, I mean, to be fair, there's quite literally nothing in... Oh, yeah, we have the balls. Yeah, there are the balls. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I see it. Okay, nice. Um, where else? There's usually like two or three of these. Oh, 
Okay, we have. I have another set of balls here. It's probably all along this camp, to be fair. Um, but yeah, I have no idea what. Oh, here we go. Poor cave. So yeah, that was nice. There should be at least one or two more. Perhaps outside the camp. Yep, here is one. Okay. Gotta find the balls though. The balls could be anywhere. Well, they're not... <laughs> They're most likely not going to be really that far off. Uh, yeah, but I just cannot see them. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> ah, you sneaky bugger. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Okay. Yeah, that should be it then. Mm-hmm. Of course he would, he was an idiot. Okay. I should be level 31 now. Okay, nice. Let's actually go. There you are. Well, I don't actually mind. Well, given the fact that I did accidentally summon him, might as well, you know, get rid of him. I love how he just puts him in a bag. Yeah, really. Okay, I need that beast, whatever that beast may be. A castle must have been quite stiff. Okay, so the beast should be somewhere around here. There we go, there's a the dark claw. Aha. Gotcha, bitch. Assignment's all finished. Nice. Okay, now we can actually move on over here. Could it be a Merlin trial? I know it's so it's so unlikely for a Merlin trial to be present. I mean it's so unusual. Probably, but uh, no need to worry yourself about it. Mm. I got rid of these guys. What's that? Yeah, yep. There we go, and kabam. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, okay, that was a double slice right there. Okay, that was a nicely done hit as well. Okay, you're done for. And... Oh. That should be it, I believe. Or maybe not. Rebellion. I'm not sure. I don't know, there are a couple more of them up there. Okay. 
Yeah, that should be it. Okay, that was a lot of trials, a lot of stipulations, and a lot of stuff. Okay. Now we have the ancient magic to do. Let's do the ancient magic. Okay, there's one over there, one in there, and one up there. Okay, so bam. Nice, I like it how it shows you at the beginning, then after that it's all about, you know, finding it yourself, more or less. Okay, nice. And one over here. Okay. Oh, those are spiders. Okay, in all honesty, I thought it was something else. Will I get an increase in my magic or no? I guess not yet. And yeah, we have those guys over there. Might as well take care of them, you know? It will be a shame not to. Still alive. Concentrate on the spoils we'll be leaving with. Crap. You made a free. Yeah, these vultures are really the scum of the scum. Get over here. Ah, okay, nice. Revelio. Uh. Yeah, that's a bunch of spiders right there. What is this over here? Uh -huh. Okay. Who lived here, I wonder? I mean, in all honesty, who cares? Just jump down when I tell you to jump down and that's it. There's really no reason for you to think about anything else besides what I tell you to. Okay. There we go. Okay, there's that. Okay, Reparo, perhaps. Okay, if not Reparo, then Confringo. Nice. Okay, I believe we're out and about with the boonies for today. Let's go back to Hogwarts and let's go back to the room of requirement. Oh, well. Okay, not that one, I need the other one. Quests. Let's go ahead and return to Deek. Perhaps I won't even need to actually do it. Because that's a waste of resources. I've rescued. Excellent. Now, to breed your Thestrals, then use the pen to start the process. I shall. Uh huh. Deke never grows tired of the room's surprises. We now have the perfect place for those Thestrals. Please let Deke know once you've bred them. Okay, hold on. I still need to go to the...
previous location and retrieve the other one uh, right and over here there should be another one yeah there he is Niffler Sepulchuria get over here there you go Nice. Okay, uh, hold on. Let me actually. Species 3 out of 4. Let's put that one in. And let's put the Diri Claw here as well. Nice. Then we're just going to go back over here. We're going to, need to go back to the swamp thingy. Okay. Manage bits. Bam, bam. One male, one female. There you go. Then I will need to conjure up a breathing pen. There you go. Large beast that keeps your beast fed. Wait, I can just conjure that and keep them fed. Well, that's convenient. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, okay. Use the breathing pen. Okay. Okay. Ah, okay. Well, hold on. So I'll need to come back to this in half an hour. Let me then uh, conjure up the rest of... Uh, you know the bread, the feeding pens for these guys, so they don't actually die out. Beast feeder, there you go. Beast toy box, there you go. Building pieces, ground surface, okay. Building pieces, okay. Outdoor items. Small items, with the statue, wishing well. Oh yeah, this will make things definitely more easier. Oh look at that, some flies. If only I could get, get it to be automatically petted as well. That would be amazing, then I could just not do anything at all, basically, and just come and collect the resources. There is probably a thing for that, but for now, let me just go ahead and place a feeding bench. Now that's for breeding, I want for feeding. I know it might sound similar, but it is indeed not. There we go. Nice. Okay, yeah, that'll be done in like half an hour, so... Yeah.